Hey, Juvenile here, and today we are playing old school Call of Duty 4. No, not the like the old school game, but like I mean like old because it's like from 2006. I don't. Know. That was a bad, bad attempt at a joke. Anyway, I'm uh I'm using a red dot M16 and I'm playing Domination on Pipeline and. From that spawn, you can really either capture C or B. They're both about an equal distance away. They're, that spawn definitely has a domination advantage, I think. Uh, but I choose to not be a team player at this moment in time and run up into this building to try to get a quick kill streak. Although, I'm telling you right now, not you know like a spoiler alert, that doesn't happen. I get stuck up here because their entire team had the same idea. So... I thought this guy was going to keep going up the ladder, but oh, he was a sneaky bastard. He decided to, you know, be smart because he saw his teammate's dead body drop from the ladder after I blew his dome piece off. So, I'm still up here trying to not die, and I figure right now I'm going to go kill two birds with one stone. I'm going to go around behind them and capture C and get out of danger. That's like three birds, but in fact, Big Mike 97 with an M14 shoots me in the back. So, I had a restart all over again with my kill streaks, And we don't have B or C, which is kind of bad. That's okay, though. That's okay. I will we'll be a team player eventually. That guy has a light machine gun, and I ended up getting an assist on him, even though I hit him with a burst of M16. That's alright. It's okay. So, right here, they're still in this building. I don't know what it is. They're really trying to get into this building. I mean, it's a tactical advantage to be in this building because you can see B and C so th this guy he climbs up the ladder and he seems to think that spinning around in circles or running around in circles rather will prevent me from seeing him that didn't end up happening so I'm in here I light those guys up that guy tries to get in the door past me it doesn't work so now I've got an airstrike and I'm running back in here and in, as you can see on the radar their entire team is essentially clustered right there I thought this was going to be a decent airstrike but eh, there's a bunch of buildings and stuff, it really wasn't going to turn out well, but I, I was almost positive I was going to get a chopper because uh, I'm capturing C and their entire team is rushing at C, so yeah, that's that's how it was going to work. I, I got a chopper. So now I'm s safe at C. We've got all the points captured. Why do you use Juggernaut and Last Stand? I don't get it. I don't understand. Is it necessary to use a perk that gives you extra health, then a perk that gives you an extra life. That makes a minimum of three bursts with an M16 to kill you. That is retarded. That is so stupid. If you use that, stop. Just stop right now. By the way, my perks are Bandolier, Stop, and Power, Steady Aim. I use that on almost every class, especially in respawn game modes. In search, I'll switch it to like Dead Silence and Bomb Squad, but not not for respawn because I, as you see, I'm blowing through bullets on on this kill streak and. Uh, steady aim. Steady aim on the M16 makes it as good as any submachine gun up close. It really does. Uh, so that's why I use it on the M16. I use it on every gun, actually. Basically. Basically every gun. So I'm running back over here as because I've got my UAV. I'm constantly looking at my radar in Call of Duty 4 because not many people use UAV, Jim. It's not like Black Ops where every single person on the enemy team uses guns. So now they've got three red dots up there, which is not good. So, I figure, alright, well, they want to be sneaky and go up there. I'm going to be sneaky and use the entrance to that roof that no one uses. I don't know why, but it seems that their entire team wanted to climb up the ladder inside, but you can just kind of hop up on this roof. So I go in here, and it turns out my teammates are going to really clear most of them out, because, or that helicopter did, because this roof is open. I've gotten good airstrikes in there. Um, so I'm running out of ammo. Um, I was thinking about just completely ditching my M16, but I've, I've still got a couple bursts. That's enough to kill somebody. And uh, right now, I will uh, prove that after I light this guy up with the P90. The P90 is great. It's bordering on overpowered, I think. But none of the guns in this game are truly overpowered. I, I, you can use any gun in this game and do well. It's not, it's not like Black Ops where if you uh, the AK-74, you, you have a distinct advantage. Your Modern Warfare 2 world, if you're using the UMP, you have a distinct advantage. So right now, I'm going to empty those last few bullets of my M16 clip into the guy with Juggernaut and Last Stand. Fantastic idea, again. It's beyond me why you need to do that. I don't... I don't see the possible need to do that. So I... 
just got double team there, and I just couldn't couldn't finish up decent. Couldn't finish up my kill streak to get it to like 20. I like getting 20 kill streaks. Like having 20 flash across my screen. I almost killed him. I really thought I could. Uh, it was a tight window of opportunity. I couldn't get it. Now, did you by any chance? happened to hear the sniper rifle bullets pouring out of my teammate's sniper right there trying to kill the stationary. Mind you, he was stationary. He wasn't moving. He was laying down. He was attempting so much, so hard, to kill that guy, and he failed so badly, so I had to come in and clean up his mess with an M16. So I'm back on the roof. Uh, like I told you, you can just run around this roof in circles. From right here, you can see B and C, which is a ridiculous advantage, because, especially when they, they're spawn trapped at B, when that, that's a weird thing to say, because, like, no map has a spawn trap at B. I think this is the only map in Call of Duty history that that is a thing, a spawn trap at B. So, they're basically all spawning at B, and I'm, well, I'm sitting up here, and, uh, well, I'm picking them off as they run through their little fence, and I'm one away from a chopper, not to spoil it again, but I don't get it, I thought I could, but I get sniped, I, yep, yep, I hard scope, I hard, I lay down and hard scope into a window, that's a, yeah, you're so good at this game, fruit troll, what the hell kind of name is fruit troll, what are you thinking when you make some of these names, people, I mean, come on now, thought that XX Big Mike 27 was a good idea. I'm honestly disappointed that I didn't get that kill. But it's alright, because I think that was one of my last deaths, if not my last death. I'm not really sure. Nope, this is my last death right here. Because I, I'm that guy at sea, he must have been under the train because I thought, well, I thought he was just going to be laying on the ground. But anyway, we're getting dominated right now, which is not a good thing. That is, that is really not a good thing. Um, because we are getting no points, and the other team is getting all the points. So, our team is like, it's all right, we'll get, we got it, we'll go capture some points. So our team's on A right now. Uh, we're also trying to capture C. I was like, I'll give you some covering fire at C. I'll make sure they don't come get you. So, uh, <laughs> so now I'm getting shot at, but it's okay because this roof, if you run, you know, off to the side, you will be in complete cover. So now we got C. That's good. If we capture another point, chances are, eh, well, if we didn't capture another point, it's, it's a tough call right now, I don't feel like doing the math in my head, but it's alright, it doesn't matter now because I'm going to get uh, another chopper, because right now we've got C and A, they are spawn trapped to me, they cannot move, and as long as, you know, like, I'm on this roof and there's some people over near A and there's some people over near C, they are not moving from me, they can't get out. That's what happens, that's, that's the Call of Duty 4 spawning system in domination. They spawn near the flag that they have captured. So, as you can see on the UAV, just the red dots are all at B. So, I decided to hop off my roof towards the end of the game and uh, run into their spawn. I've got my chopper. Worst case scenario is that I die uh, and have to restart my kill streak and I'm fine with that. So, I'm just over the, I mean, I don't, I don't know why we dominated them, I don't advocate that, it's not a good idea, especially when you can just, because when, when they're dominated, they stop spawning at one flag, so anyone out there watching this that thinks you have to capture every single flag in domination, that's not true, don't do it, it's not good, and it bothers those trying to get many kills. I mean, come on now. Think about it. If there's three flags in the game, you have two of them for the whole game, you still win the game. Think about it. Think about it, and I get the last kill, and that's it. So, if you've learned one thing, leave one flag, preferably C or A on a map. This is one rare case where it's B. So that's it for me. Bye, guys. Play some Call of Duty 4.